Hello everyone, this is Dan. We are today getting into Simulacra. Um, I haven't heard very much about this game, but uh, yeah, I hear it's kind of trippy. And given the music right now, I've, I'm definitely thinking that is not far from the truth. So let's get into this and see what see what we're uh, gonna get into here. Begin. I did a initial test on this just to make sure that it was working for recording, and uh, yeah, so uh -huh. it does get really trippy. The hint is Toby's birthday, but we obviously don't have any info, and it just got all trippy. So here we know that. The first number is one, second number is eight, zero, and seven. So January 8th, 2007. I don't know if that's her kid. Um, that's a, I think this is an older game, so I'm not sure. Let's turn off the phone. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Um, I guess we'll go to the gallery. 99 videos, what? Alright, it's all the same video. <laughs> if you look into my eyes, you can see it looking back. Whoa. Can you see it? It's all distorted. I just wanted to be happy. <laughs> my name is Anna, my name is Anna. I don't want to take anyone else! <laughs> my name is Anna, my name is Anna. <laughs> Is she, um, is she being possessed? Iris memos. Pending. Find Anna. She said don't find her! Uh, system restore. Please wa wait while we restore your device. Do not switch off while restoration is in progress. It looks like an Android phone. Because uh, this looks like Google Photos right here. Although, this looks like Microsoft Edge. Oh, lots of chats from Greg here. Uh, what, what is it? Oh, this is the notifications. New message from Greg. Talk to him. Alright, let's go to the chat. Merv. Hey, you still with your boyfriend? Come on, Merv. Just asking. People are talking. Have you considered that the things you might you say might come that the things you say might come ah uh, oh come off as creepy? Creepy? I'm just speaking my mind. Nothing wrong with that. Isn't company policy to get to know your colleagues better as well? Yeah, but you need to tone it down, way down. Telling me to wear my bareback dress because it looks hot is not appropriate. You're making a big deal out of this. I'm just being honest. I can't even tell you you're pretty. I don't get it. You're being way too sensitive. Dude, you're a simp. Chill, lol. I'm gonna be your giver for the gift swap. You're gonna love what I have in mind for you. Ugh, that sounds like a stalker already. Mom? Anna, I have these cookies I need to pass to you. Mom, some other time, please? I told you, I have tiny shelves. There isn't any more space for food. It's only a box of them. Then why can't you finish it? Can't a mother bring her daughter some food? I don't need it. Why aren't you answering your phone? Are you still there? Mom, all I ask is some space, okay? So you only want to see me when you need something. That's not true, Mom. Then why are you avoiding me? I am not. Then let me come over. I am busy. You're always busy. It's like we are strangers now. Mom. I just want you to be supportive of my decision. That is all. Supportive? You say it as if I would never do anything for you. Who paid your rent when you took three months off to do that silly self-help course? Whoa. Judgmental much, mom? You tell me it's going to be good for you, but what do you have to show at the end? All I ask is that you come see your mother every once in a while. Is that so difficult for you? Fine, mom. Next time. I promise. Good. Anna. Aunt Penny is coming over for a visit soon. I hope you are keeping to your promise. 
Yeah, I can make it. I will call you on. I will call you on when and where. I heard about what happened. Maybe it's time you listen to me for once and let it go. The world is not run by silly mantras or your sense of purpose. It is a material world. You work and you get paid. You live your life based on that. It's not that complicated. You have that already, so why are you so desperate to throw it away? About time you take what you have and be happy with it. You think I love what I do? You think anyone, anyone loves what they do? I want to support you. I really do, but not at the expense of your security. If you want to change your pace, Aunt Penny has a position in her company. It's doing quite well. Maybe I can recommend you. Are you there? Answer me so I don't have to file a missing persons report. Sorry, I'm at work. Just want to drown everything out for a bit. It's just, every possible shitty thing that could happen, happened at the same time, and it sucks. I know you're worried, but I'm okay. I'll call you soon, I promise. Love you. Sounds like mom really wants to uh, try to look out for her daughter, but uh, her daughter's just not happy right now. Have you talked to Aunt Penny yet? Hi, mom. Yeah, but... I don't, want, I don't want to work at a PR firm. You said you want something different. Here I am trying to help you out. Again, you turn it down. What is it you want? Maybe if you listen to me, really listen, then you might come closer to understanding. She consults at a pet store, and that is not the same. Nothing is ever enough for you, is it? Ungrateful. I gave you much, and this is the treatment I get. Fine. I am sorry I am such a disappointment. I am trying to be better, but please, this is my own way. So much is happening right now. All I ask is that you trust me. I got nothing to show you now, but I will not give up. Okay. You know I do this because I love you, right? Yeah. Love you too, Mom. Yeah, don't be overprotective, Mom. You gotta let her grow. Hello? Hello? Oh, man. I mean, she's probably not questioning anything because it sounds like Anna's been very standoffish lately. Ashley. It happened again. Ugh. Long day, huh? Let me guess. It's the meetings again, right? How late can someone be for a team meeting? Half an hour. And I get called to my office for extending my lunch time just by five minutes. Nailed it. Being the editor-in-chief doesn't turn you into the queen of the world. It was so last minute and I had to rush like a maniac. Dropped everything just to be on time. Had to skip my afternoon latte. Got grumpy and scowled at the assistant again. Shit. This is the second time I lost my shit this week. See, you gotta be chill and watch your temper. No, it's my watch. I thought I had it with me. I can't remember where I put it. Oh. Do you want me to check my place? Never mind, I'm sure it will turn up somewhere. You will lose your head if it wasn't attached to you. I'm not sure what this emoji is. You still want to go out later? Yes, please. Vortex Club. Ha <laughs> ha. Okay, talk to you later then. I've got to finish an application first. Hey, on my way. Well, six hours later. Okay. Hi, hi, hi. Why'd you leave? Greg wasn't feeling it. You missed out. Dancing with me. Ha ha ha. Next time, I promise. Anyways, looks like you had fun with Victor. I did have fun with Victor. Ha ha. Night. Night. Thanks for listening to me. That's what I'm here for. Try to get some rest, okay? I can't believe that guy. Shit. You know what he literally just did? Oh wait, wait, don't tell me. Let me guess. He didn't lift the toilet seat. And tell you that that it's your responsibility too. You know that happened to me once. Ashley. Sorry, sorry. Okay, tell me. So, I confronted him about it, and he again denied it. Oh. <laughs> Message corrupted. Select the words in the correct order to rebuild the message. So... Um... I took his phone and showed it to him. No way. You looked through his phone? Shocked face. It's wrong. I know. I'm not the jealous type. Really, I'm not. I know that, babe. But it was just there. A message came in, and I just looked. Hey, I'm not judging. Whatever it takes to be completely sure, you know? At least now you know. You can let the whole thing go now. You should see his face. 
and he has the nerve to accuse me of invading his privacy? He yelled at me. I told him to leave, and that's the end of it. Hugs from me, okay? So, what did he say he's going to do about it? Honestly, I don't know. I don't want to know. Hurts to think about. Thanks, Ashley. For what? Listening. I know it's very di a very difficult thing for you to do. Lol, beesh. Tongue stick out. Just let me know if you need anything, okay? Anything. She sounds like a good friend. Greg. This is the guy she was talking to. Pick up my calls, will you? Please, come on. Alright, another corrupted one. You are the one that went out of line? No. That went out of line. I agree. I mean, if you took someone's phone without their permission, that that's kind of going a little too far. When you went, you were you were the one that went out of line when you went through my property. I'm not even mad, just disappointed. But I know you are, so talk to me. I can explain every everything. I will let you cool off first. Hello, it's been a while. How are you feeling? Four days later. I am taking care of everything, okay? Just give me a few days, and I will sort things out. You can't ignore me forever, Anna. In two more days. Can you stop being so emotional right now? This is difficult for me, too. It's not just you. That shit is punishing enough for me, so I don't need your crap as well. Could you just hear me out for one minute? One? It's settled. You have nothing to worry about anymore. We need to talk in person, so please answer me. Anna? Fuck this silent treatment shit! Oh, fuck it so much! I get it. Fuck it. But I get it. Get back to me when you're ready. I'm gonna give you a week. Okay? I wanna give you space. Wow, he sounds like a Giga Chad. Like, frat bro Giga Chad. They said you didn't come into work today, and you're blocking my calls now? Where on earth are you? I wonder if this is Anna's phone, or if we just happen to pick up her phone and put our, our own SIM card in it. Uh, should we reply? Recently added. Vlogger. So this one is new. These are still sinking. I'm guessing they're not going to sink for a while. Is this bar moving? No, it's not. It's just pulsating. Okay. Hi. Hello to myself. Um, this is video log number one. I'm supposed to just speak my mind. Whatever comes, no wrong answers. Nobody's gonna see this, so. Um, work has been pretty crazy lately and I just needed an outlet of sorts. This is supposed to be therapeutic. <laughs> what am I doing? <laughs> No, I don't think that's too bad. I mean, everybody needs an outlet. Uh, a healthy one. And this looks like a healthy outlet so far. Unless this is something that led to her downfall. Alright, so I guess we need to send Greg a message here. Um, hmm. So, if we're not Anna... Why do we get these messages? And why do we even get Anna's messages in the first place? We've got, uh, and all her accounts are logged in. Let's see, who is this? You're kidding me, Anna. You give me the silent treatment. Disappear. Now you forget I exist? Anna is currently unavailable. I'm not who you think I am. I think this one makes sense. What are you rambling about? 
If this is some kind of trick to stop me from reaching you, you're better than this, Anna. You keep nagging me that, as a couple, we need more. So let's talk. Ah, uh, yeah, she lost her phone. What do you say to that, bro? Oh, you're not Anna? For real? Who is this? You're not her new fling or anything, are you? In case you are unaware, we are dating, Madface. Um, let me do this one. I don't want to be antagonistic. Yeah, I get it. So, you don't know Anna? Why are you holding her phone then? I think someone sent me this phone. This phone was left on my doorstep. I'm gonna go with this second one. She left her phone for some rando stranger? Weird. Why would she do that? Yeah, she looks like she needs- she's in trouble. I think she's in danger. I feel like that is the case, cause um... Yeah, let's go with that one. Huh? Is she okay? Yeah, she recorded something weird. Send me that video. Now! Uh, let's send it to him. He seems genuinely worried. No. Uh, it's in the videos. And... Oh, shoot. I think it's the... This one. Yeah, it's this one. He's online. He's typing. Is this some kind of sick joke? It's just static and noise. If you did something to Anna, I swear to God. Looks like it deleted itself? Yeah. Weird. Yeah, it's just static and noise. It's gone. What the frick is going on? Whoa, whoa. Alright, let's talk to Hello? him. Hello? Who the hell is this? Answer me! Where did you get the phone? Is Anna with you right now? Are you ignoring me? Damn it! Hey, why are you not talking? Uh, reception was bad, I guess? Take it off silent mode or something. Is my call not going through? He sounds genuinely worried. Shit, something came up. I'll try again later. And you better answer. Whoa. This guy looks like this guy's talking about dates? Oh, it's Spark? This is gotta be a love thing. She had other videos here. Well, what's this? Image corrupted. Select the fragments in the correct order to build the image. Huh. Um jeez. I guess we can start with this thing. And then go with this. Oh, it adds the static. Oh. Okay, so let's not go with this thing first. Let's add the ones with the static first. That go into that area. Girls working out. Okay. Eating. Fish and chips. I wonder if they th this is she's English or something. She's got a kitty cat. Loves her kitty cat. <laughs> really loves her kitty cat. And there's a friend. Coffee dough. It's like she goes, she likes macaroons, sweets. Oh, what's her 
store this one too. All right. Let's see. Let's go with this one first. No. Let's go for this one first and then this one. Oh. Blocks her head. Um, hmm. Maybe let's go with this one and then this one. This one and then this one. There we go. Taking a selfie, but it's her selfie that's the one that's here. They took each other's selfies? Looks like a uh, food coma. Food pics. Uh, the, the, there's the other selfie, except uh, the, you can see the phone, so yeah. Another one. Alright, let's see. Let's see, let's see, let's see. Um, let's start with this one. And then let's go with this one. And then this one. Oh. Uh, I need this, this one. Okay. Happy birthday. Man, lots of picks here. This is Greg. Uh, looks like it's increasing in difficulty. Um, let's start with this one and then go with this one. Uh, there we go. I was just clicking around. I don't actually know. I didn't actually know how to do these. She takes lots of food photos. I can relate. Okay. Me. Eight photos. Okay. Filter. Chat audio. Sorry, I'm at work. Just want to drown everything out for a bit. That was to her mom. Anna? Fuck this silent treatment shit! Uh, that was Greg just now, or just a moment ago. Yeah, look at these. What's this? There. Was something back there? That's weird. Oh shit! What? What went on with that? Weird. Weird. Blocker. Yeah, these things are still sinking. Surfer. Here's her. Well, she was on Spark. Looked like she was. Getting ready to get rid of uh, Greg there. Rider, hate ride hailing, Kappa feed. What totem animal spirit are you? Toby's birthday, January eighth, oh seven. Her email. All right, let's see. It looks like it's in ascending order. I don't know, because usually the latest ones show up at the top. It looks like this one's the latest one down here, 307, because it's, it's 338 now. Ed. Oh, from Anna to Ed at Faraday Security. <clears throat> Tech issues again. Hey, Ed. I think it works. Thanks again. P.S. You and your factory chain coffee. Cheers. Oh, looks like she had some, some issues here. Uh, hey, Ed. Sorry to bother you with these phone stuff again. I updated to the applesauce version of the OS, and it's pretty confusing. So recently, I reset and restored my phone... And I lost most of my chats, emails, and photos. Ugh. Weird part. Some of my message are jumbled up or something. It says it's corrupted. I couldn't find anything about it in the official forums. It's not urgent, but it's really annoying that I can't get some of my pictures back or my old text. 
would be great if you, if you could help me out again, please. Coffee's on me. Cheers. Tech support of Faraday safe, safety, not security. Hey, Anna, don't mention it. Yeah, the applesauce version of the OS is pretty buggy, but I can help you out. The encryption is based on layers, and sometimes it just fails to work and you have to do it yourself. For text, just try to guess the sentence and rearrange it manually to its original form and it will be put back together. As for pictures, just stack it in the right order. Make sure the image is above the corrected, corrupted layer. If everything's in order, your photos will be reset. Hope it helps. P.S. I don't want that hipster bullshit when we went, we went the last time. I like my coffee how the giant corporations make them. Consistent. Over and out. Interesting. So I, this troubleshooting step, I kind of just figured out. <laughs> Picked up. Let's pictures. Looks like Instagram. Angie Moore, Maya M, Serena Wills. We're excited to hear from you what you have hear from you what you have picked up this week. We noticed from your picked library that you have a thing for nature outside the city. Missing the countryside? Do upload and share. We can't wait. In the meantime, here are some images your fellow community members have picked up. Hope you ha hope they are food for thought. Oh, so this is an auto email from basically Instagram. And uh, I guess she takes a lot of photos outside. Didn't seem that way from the pictures we saw. Tim Faraday. Is this from Faraday Safety? Yep. Oh, her superior. That's the CEO. Jeez. Where are those data packets I asked for, Anna? This is the millionth time you are directly disobeying my instructions, and I'm wondering if you... <laughs> you really are putting the interest of this company first. We are a surveillance outfit, and to be the best in the business, there must be sacrifices. Otherwise, otherwise I'm forced to talk. <laughs> to question your loyalty. Please note, your repeated offense of delayed work or shoddy tasks are being put into consideration regarding your appraisal. <laughs> and this is a small industry. We decided to remove your, your access to the lab Wi-Fi. And should you be found bypassing this restriction, there will be consequences. For someone who is supposed... Who is supposed in, in surveillance, you have a poor way of show, showing your focus. Um, it seems like he did not care at all how his, uh, email came out. This probably spam, most likely. Because look at all the spelling mistakes, and it's all in caps, and it just says, your superior. Uh, if you're the CEO, you don't think that she would know? Alright, so this is from mom, Lauren. Lauren Hardy. So th this must be Anna Hardy. I heard what happened. Why didn't you tell me? You see what happened? This is what happens when you don't listen to your mother. <laughs> oh, that's so stereotypical. All I want is what is best for you. I already put you through school, and now you want to do it again? And for what? Becoming a vet? This is the third time you got rejected from that school. Maybe it's time you realize that you're not a cut out for this kind of nonsense. Everyone else is moving forward, and you're the only person I know that wants to move back. Now that I know for sure you're not going anywhere anytime soon, I suggest you put an, an end to this now. Love you, Mom. So I guess Anna wanted to move out of the, the security industry as a consultant, it seems, to being a, a vet. And um, her aunt has a consultancy firm that works with vets, but that's not quite what she wants to do. The Right Thing featured article. Students unable to feed themselves. The developed nations spend nights brooding over the issues of military defense, public health, and ailing economies. But there's a greater danger at large here, and more dangerous because it is ignored for being relatively harmless is the student debt. Oh, yeah, that is so, so true. Uh, if you couldn't tell, I am one of those people. Each year, hundreds of graduates leave their campuses, entering the workforce with certifications. 
Their earnings are nominal at best, keeping them fed and clothed with a place to stay. Life is at a minimal, and savings paltry or non-existent. That is, unless they are paying back their education debt. The growing ranks of middle-income families spark more doom than cheer, while human rights supporters sing praises for improvements in raising prosperity of the poor and homeless, including the educating of children to break out of the poverty cycle, they do not consider the increased commitments of entering a middle-income lifestyle. Student debts are by far the lowest interest rate available in banks, but for young people barely making basic wage, it is a punishing uphill battle of mathematics. With parents saddled in their own student debt and mortgage, Progressive generations of teenagers are beginning to feel the effects of taking a loan to attain their dream jobs through tertiary education. A more alarming trend is on the rise of dropouts, not because of failing grades, but from failing finances. We are merely moving the oppressive cycle from poverty to student debt, leaving families vulnerable to disruption in jobs, market forces, and currency injuries. Parents are moving their children into homeschool initiatives while others follow the age-old tradition of apprenticeship. Slowly and surely, people are taking matters into their own hands of educating their young and not becoming enslaved to the debt engine. The collapse of the economy from poverty debt has only been too clear a warning sign for us all. Thanks for subscribing to The Right Thing. So, it sounds like if she got an email like this, she probably has been looking up at... Um, student debts and stuff and if she's going back to school that's probably the case all right we got no password here forgot your password there we go check your email now all right so let's go back to the email jabber looks like twitter a request has been made to reset your password tap on the link below to reset your password What is your pet's name? Ooh. Uh. We gotta go to the photos. Let's see. No, no, no. Photos. Uh, camera. She had the cat. Tobias. There we go. Tobias. All right, that was one of three. What is your mother's maiden name? Hardy. I'm glad I saw that. What is your favorite movie? Oh. Uh, huh. I don't think we saw anything like that that would indicate a movie. Hmm. Did we see anything like that? This is not a movie theater. Hmm. This looks like a coffee shop. All right, so maybe we don't have anything just yet for that. Maybe it comes up later. I can't see anything in this picture. Yeah, probably not. Yeah, these are just glamour shots. Okay, well, let's uh, let's take a look here. If it's a like, swipe right. If it's a nope, swipe left. Sparks will fly when you both swipe right. Start chatting when you both like each other and let the sparks fly. Swipe match spark up your life. So basically, this is, uh, oh shoot. 
what is it called? Uh, dang it. Uh, Tinder, Tinder. Pat. Hey, cutie, hey there. I got a romantic proposition for you. What is it? If you sit on my face, I will eat my way to your heart. Uh, yeah, definitely Tinder. How many lobster dinners would it take to turn your bedroom into an acrobat acrobat's gym? Hey, I'm talking to you here. Wow. Tell me, Anna, what are your Monday priorities? Movies? Yoga? Happy houring? Uh-oh, no response. You need some rescuing? Sorry, I was cut up with work. I'm here. I would pick none of the above, actually. I recently picked up reading, otherwise it might be movie. Awesome. Anything interesting you picked up? You won't believe me if I told you. Tell. Philosophy. I just heard someone sighing. I believe you. You're just saying that. So, are you always into the human condition? Nah, I'm just going through some stuff right now. It just helps me put things into perspective. How about you? Are you as good as advertise? We can meet up. I will tell you all about it. Come on, I told you something about me. It's your turn. Tell me about your work. Well, I did it a while back. How long was that? Three years. Kind of misleading, isn't it? It got your attention, right? It's all part of the game anyways. Aren't our profiles just better versions of ourselves? Call me an idealist, but putting an honest foot forward goes a long way. I agree. Y you should be truthful when you're looking for love. Like your pick. Thanks. Want to eat cookie dough sometime together? Excuse me? What? I mean, you want to go out sometime together? You there? Eat cookie dough. Dude, that... I don't, I don't even know what you're going for there. there. Hey. Hey, animal lover, huh? You have one? Yeah, cat. Oh, I see you have pets too. Haha, <laughs> no, I don't. It's a joke. They're Pokemons. Like the mobile game? The crazy popular one? That's the one. Though the original was created in 1995 for the Game Boy, I played it. I mean, the re-release. Hence the joke. Because you have to pick one of those three. And I played all three versions. Charmander is my favorite. Unrelated trivia, do you know that the most expensive Pokemon card is the Charizard? Which is evolved from a Charmander? Right. You play games? I was a Candy Crush nut for a bit. I wouldn't count that as a game. How is Candy Crush not a game? I mean like a real game. If Candy Crush is not a real game, what is it? Like PCs or consoles. I played Mario Kart at a party once. I think that's pretty much it. Ah, uh, yeah. Uh, this guy. Yeah, that's not how you pick up, ladies, my dude. You like to travel, right? Your name should be Wonder Woman. Get it? Come on. Not even a pity laugh. I'll just assume you're busy saving the world. Would it be considered catcalling if I called your cat? I have a grand night of a date planned out for him, her, it. So grand, it might even have room for you. Uh... You see, this is, this guy, he's got the dad jokes. She's not on her phone right now. Oh, awkward. You're a roommate? Anna and I don't know each other. And you're having her phone because it somehow landed on my doorstep. Total Stranger picks up a lost phone and responds to Spark messages. Isn't that kind of creepy? Like you wouldn't do the same? Right. That's cool. As long as you return the phone to her, you are going to return it, right? If you know where she is. Why, why would he know? He just started messenger, messaging her. I will if I can find her. Finding girls is the whole point of Spark, am I right? I guess I'll have to pick up my pickup lines after she gets her phone back. I thought my Wonder Woman joke would have sealed the deal, don't you agree? You know, I chuckled a little bit. Ha! Two out of three times, it works 100% of the times. I'll let her be the judge. Put a good name for me if she comes back. It's Taylor Pereira. Tell her I'll be waiting.
Uh, I guess the contact got updated. So this is her prof profile. You're here too, so don't judge. Rick works at Faraday Solutions, yep. Dreams of making a living out of playing with animals. You might find me in a small and quirky bookstore if I'm not stuck in my dead-end job. A good joke and warm coffee is all I need for a good time, so don't work too hard, okay? Oh, and being charming as hell works too. A girl could use more of that. Anything less than a rebound or a hookup, please look elsewhere. I'm looking for the real thing. Are you there? Nope, her phone is still with me. The wait is killing me! Okay, girl loses her phone. Gotta be more to the novella than that. Hmm. Why wouldn't Anna call her own phone by now? Did you check her, check her text messages? Of course I did. Not sure if Anna wants you to know about her... Uh, of course I did. Uh, of course she did. So what do we have? Still working on it. He doesn't need to know about Greg. That's her, that's her problem, you know? I get it. It must be packed with juicy details. Anything else? <sighs> it looks like it wants me to go this way. Greg? Who's Greg? Eh, someone close to her, I'm just gonna say. Hmm. Must be a boyfriend. Eh, he, he got there. Damn it, more competition. Nothing much to go on for now. Hmm. Okay, bud. Time for the next level. You're gonna dig a, a little deeper. Is her email open? Oh. What is she like on Jabber? <clears throat> Way ahead of you, bud. <clears throat> Someone's a natural, Snoop. Alright, Snoopy. Do your thing. If you find anything at all, I want to hear it. I'd be... I'll be right here. Okay. Hey, hey! Found anything interesting yet? Anything that tells me more about Anna? Us? Tell us? Interesting in reading her emails? Oh, please do tell. Uh, I don't know. I'm just gonna go with just a bunch of spam. I don't know. She likes meat that much. But, um, tsh. I think you should keep looking. I'm just gonna clear away from here. Oh, it's the only thing, though. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Hello? 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 I know you're there. Yeah, I'm trying you to sit. up. Why aren't you answering? I'm saying stop. Serious, okay? Oh, say something! Dude, come on. Say something. Why the frick are you not talking? Can you relax? I only hear noise. Ugh, we're wasting time. Whoever you are, I need your help. This is bad. She's not answering her door, and she isn't at work. Anna always notifies when she isn't coming in, even when she's five minutes late. Well, she did lose her phone, so how would she be able to contact you? Pretty sure she'll find a way to call the office. This time around, not a word. It's not like her at all. This video you, s you claim to see, you sure that's Anna? Anna's the girl on the wallpaper, right? Yep, only with makeup running down her face. I'm gonna go with this one. And she didn't say anything about where she is or what happened to her? She was freaking out. What the hell? I swear, if you're making this shit up, damn it. Who are you exactly? I mean, I'm sure you're a boyfriend. Okay, I realize how all this looks. I'm Greg Summers, Anna's boyfriend. We had a small disagreement. Now she is not talking to me. Right. Anything in her phone that indicates where she might be? Her jabber. 
She updates it all the time. Can you take a peek at it? See where she went? I can't log in. You want me to stalk her? Hey! Something might happen to her. Yeah. It's just a peek at her jabber, and we can practically track her. Just to see if any everything is alright. All I need is one face-to-face -face conversation with her. Okay, I don't really care about your drama. I don't. You're still here. That says something. Uh, I don't know. I want to actually go there. I just heard a knock. And it just freaked me out just a little bit. Because I'm wearing headphones. And I know it's the game. But still, like, super creepy. Uh, you're kidding me. She's already moving on. Is she matched with anyone yet? How is this relevant? Yeah, for real. She might be in trouble. This is about principles. We had one fight. This bastard's got a name. Uh, I don't know. I want to I wanna talk to him about this. That's her business. But it looks like I got to go there. Taylor. Fuck. I don't want to know. I will deal with it when I find her. I think Jabber is our only option. Just look through it and let me know the last post she did. It's password protected. Ugh. Is she this uptight even on her phone? Just let me know when you find something, okay? Be quick. Yeah, do you know her favorite movie? I need that. If we are back to speaking terms... Dude, just... That can't be the name of the movie. What kind of boyfriend are you, if you don't know her favorite movie? Hey, I know the important things, alright? And I don't need you judging me right now. What do you want to know, her favorite movie any anyway? I can a The last security question. Oh, so you're close. Hmm. Her best friend Ashley might know. Text her, but do it as Anna. She might freak out if she finds out if Stranger is using Anna's phone. So let's keep this under wraps. I can't lie about that. They are both close. If she knows you're a complete stranger, she might not give you anything. It's easy, just get what you need. And no one needs to know what happened. That's so sus, man. Let's check out the email that came in. Unusual login attempt. Dear Anna, we have detected an unusual login attempt into your Jabber account from this IP address. If this is you, you may ignore this message as your account is still secure. Okay, let's go back to Jabber. Is it still asking for that security question? Yes. Okay. So I guess we're going to go into chats. Just let me know if you need anything, okay? Anything. Um, I'm just gonna go, hi, Ashley. She's gonna know it's not Anna right away. Anna, oh my god, you won't believe what I just saw. You can't tell anyone that I told you. Um, what is it? I'm not gonna pro make promises on anyone's behalf. Okay, I know you're sick of talking about Greg, but I saw Yolanda at my building holding a Ferris and Kane's footwear bag. So, I walked up to her, played it cool, pretend to ask for her card and stuff, right? Turns out that skank buys stuff for other people. I didn't realize a job like that even existed. Sounds kind of lame, don't you think? I do. Sucks the fun out of shopping, like, what if you want to return something? You return it to them or they will return it on your behalf? Shopping is pretty straightforward. Why would anyone complicate things? Also, she looks... Fine? I don't think she's... Maybe she dealt with it. I wonder what this... this is all about. <sighs> I 
Do I pretend to be her? Let's just go with this. Uh, I don't want to hear about that. Sorry, last time. I promise. You want to say something? What's my favorite movie? Er, random? Is this an imposter test? It's really me, Ashley. Laugh out loud. Just want to know that my friends know me. Never know who's texting you. I'll go with this one. Seems very innocuous. Seriously, Anna? Is this about Greg? This isn't like you. Hey, she should know the answer. Just answer the question. Mm, I don't want to be so forceful. Wasn't it a dog's purpose? Come on, Anna. You don't have to test me like that. Thank you, Ashley. You seem a little off, Anna. I'll give you some space. Talk to you later. Alright, let's go back to Jabber. Alright. A. Dogs. No. Uh, where's... Uh, here's the apostrophe. A dog's... Purpose. There we go. The gift of Jab. Oh, she's a Bob Ross fan. Cool. I wonder how far this get down this goes. Whoa, it goes pretty far. She follows Cassie. Hardest part is getting the glitter off. They should have an indecisive line at food fast food. Yeah, I agree with that. I've never, ever held a fidget spinner. Did I miss my window? Fun fact, ice cream buffets are the leading cause of food comas. It's not all the time two wrongs make a wrong, right? Two times make a right. Santa Monica, California. Oh, didn't see you there. I'm just standing around. Ever notice how weird feet are? Am I high? Look at him. Slot machines are a waste of money to me, but then I bought an ironic dress to a party. What the fuck do I know? I wonder why do I give so many chances? There are two sides of me. Okay, I'm going to try out Spark. Going to give it 12 hours before I get my first pick of a penis. Yeah, I, I think 12 hours is a little generous. Hey all, as a token of appreciation for my fans and celebration of almost hitting 200,000 followers, I'm planning something really special. Stay tuned. If I catch a kid staring at me, I should lick my lips to warn them that there are bad people in the world. Okay. Taylor, you are, um, you are, you are now grossing me. Anna, Ash Ketchum, is a perfect human being. Mm, sounds like she likes Pokemon, too. Ever wanted to ask me anything? Uh, stand a chance to... Stand a chance to talk to me in my upcoming Jabber contest. Looks like she's had some... Some things said here. Thank you for letting me use your phone. Oh! She's Ashley. Ash Ketchum. Oh. Lol, beach. And she's liked a number of things here. I think that was the first one where she had a comment, though. So she follows and likes this person, Cassie. And she... This is Ashley here. Ash Ketchum. A Ashley is the... Um... Is the Pokemon fan. Keep an eye on my upcoming post. Find the hidden phone number. If you figure it out, just call me for your AMA with me. I ate an entire pizza by myself in five minutes. It's nine in the morning. Why am I craving Chinese food? Spark is full of fakies saying the same thing. Most of their profiles are hot too. How is he following her? Two days in a row, the barista spelt my name as Cassie with a K. Girl. Hey, you look troubled. Me. Oh, it's nothing. Girl, what's on your mind? Me. How do porcupines have sex? 
carefully. Toby's face, uh, after I decide to go for fresh fish. I regret nothing. Nothing. A movie should not be three hours long. My bladder can't handle it. To make an omelet, you have to break a few eggs. Sometimes you add cheese or ham. I prefer mushrooms. Four push-ups. I'm off the chains today. New Game of Thrones episode in eight hours. Feeling real healthy. Just bought a bunch of fruits and vegetables. Here's to two weeks from now when I throw it all away because of rot. It's rotten. Crowd is insane. One gay. I'm going to wear my grandmother's sweater. Today is not that day. Yeah, you're barely wearing anything, Cassie. Ah, oh, this game is like, it, it told me to wear headphones, this game, and it's, I'm, I'm realizing now it's because it's going to send weird sounds into my headphones. I just heard like a lip smacking. Taylor sees girl reading a, to kill a mockingbird. Great book. Who knew that those damn birds are so hard to kill? Dad joke still. Swag. Why are some of the best English words made up of four letters? <laughs> I could think of a few. Uh, you know you're old when you relate to the parents in kids' movies. Mm. Case study gives zero fucks. Anna. If you type everything in caps, it sounds like you're screaming. Isn't this general knowledge? Yeah, and also all the misspellings, too. He was, must have been pissed. I'm sorry if it's too loud. Well, not you, Ron. You be you. That's the end of the contest. I hope you guys enjoyed it as much as I do. Does it really take eight weeks to review an application? You're obsessed with me. I get it. The fan AMA will be published in an article. Only the best ones get picked. Make it count. The sequel to The Edge of Tomorrow should be the exact same movie. Uh, I don't know that I agree with that. Fell asleep and the pizza guy was ringing the doorbell for 10 minutes. Awkward. Yeah, that is awkward. You should offer him a slice. Too hangry. Nobody gets my pizza. Just tip them. <laughs> People who are 5 feet are only 5 subs long. Think about it. Find out Found out today that charm still exists. Smiley faces. Today is going to be a good day. Spills coffee on dress, changes into better looking outfit. Today is going to be a good day. I just washed my cat. By wash, I mean shaved. And by cat, I mean... Oh. Okay. I should randomly put glasses on people's dogs. And they will go, where's my dog? That's a Superman reference for you guys that don't know. He puts glasses on and he's Clark Kent. Where'd Superman go? After looking back at some posts from four years ago, I just realized how f freaking awesome I am. Okay. Any dentist recommendation? Somewhere near my area would be great. My dentist asked his assistant to suck the water out of my mouth, thinking he was talking to me, so I sucked his finger. I'm terrified. I can't feel my face when I'm with you. Yeah, is he... What is he holding here? Oh, all these dental util utensils or um, tools. It looked like it was a whisk at first to me. Super productive day. I only nap two times during work. This guy. Gotta have opposites, dark and light. Light and dark in painting. It's like in life. Gotta have a little sadness once in a while so you know when the good times come. I'm waiting on the good times now. How do you win a war on drugs? It's hard to win a war without drugs as it is. That is a good point. And some more dad jokes. Alright, I think you should keep looking. Oh, what was that? Just one minute ago? We didn't send this. Is it like a million degrees out there, or is it just me? Gotta chill at home for now. How did this thing just update? One minute ago. We've got our phone. Yeah, because look, the last update was three months ago, and now one minute ago? 
What? What is going on? Whoa, whoa, whoa. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh. Oh. Um. Okay. That got me. That got me. I, um. I think that's going to be it for today. I just, um. Uh, I need a minute. Okay. Um. Ooh. Calm down, calm down. All right, um, I'm gonna stop for here or for now. Um, we're we're really sleuthing and digging into it right now, so let's continue this next time. And until then, bye.